Welcome to BevNerd Video Podcast. I'm your host Jason, the BevNerd Coleman. This is episode 159, and we're trying a snack slash dessert product that I found at Walmart. This is Taco Bell Chocolate Taco Dessert Kit. Uh, this is actually my second attempt to do this review. I was wanting to get this out a couple, couple three weeks ago, and I uh, picked this up at Walmart, got home, uh, and not only were my dreams crushed, all the taco shells were crushed. And you saw the picture on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook that I posted. So what I did, took it back with the receipt and um, got a new box. Uh, we're gonna be going to the Bevner Test Kitchen because I'm gonna try to put hand-dipped ice cream into probably the most fragile food envelope there is, a crunchy taco shell. Nothing could absolutely go wrong, right? And, and then this box itself, it comes with six chocolate taco shells, sprinkles, and chocolate syrup. You provide the ice cream and the whipped cream. Uh, but somebody asked me, it's like, well, you, the taco shells are broken, why don't you just make nachos? Well, they already have a nachos product, plus I wanted to see how terribly bad I could be at making ice cream tacos. Let's see how this goes in the kitchen. Okay, here we are with the taco shell dessert, the chocolate taco dessert kit. Bag of sprinkles. And here are the taco shells, because I wanted to uh, attempt to do this one time before I did this review. Here's the chocolate taco shell. Mm, not really smelling like chocolate, but let's go ahead and make this while the ice cream is still very frozen. We've got some bluebell vanilla ice cream. It said to use a teaspoon, so I'm just going to use one of my daughter's baby spoons because that'll probably be a little bit easier. Uh oh. So what I'm doing is just, you know, filling the taco. That's what she said. Oh boy, that one's rough. Uh, the ice cream has been in my, it's, it's pretty cold, so, but it's soft, so it's going on there pretty easily. Okay, that looks, looks pretty, pretty decent. Alright, next comes the chocolate sauce in the middle. Ooh. Okay, got the chocolate sauce drizzle. Time for the whip, whip topping. Uh oh. All right, got the whip topping. And sprinklies. Hey, that's, that almost kind of looks like the picture. Nailed it. Now let's go review this before this melts. Now it's time for the first taste of the chocolate dessert taco. I need a bib. Ugh. That is a mess, <laughs> but I didn't have to tell you that, did I? Um, yeah. The chocolate syrup is way too sweet. It's really, really rich, but it's like, it's like super sickening sweet. Um, sprinkles are sprinkles, can't go wrong. Uh, my ice cream and whipped topping are fine. But let's talk about this taco shell. It sucks. Um, I barely get any hint of chocolate. It's like, it's in the ingredients. I mean, it's, it's kind of got a cocoa taste to it. But all I get is just corn. I get corn like a real taco shell with a hint of chocolate. Why did they do it with a real taco shell? I would have much preferred something that tasted like an ice cream cone, an ice cream cone shell. Or heck, how about a waffle cone shell? Um, I'm dripping on the floor, uh-oh. Um, that would have been ten times better, I think, and it probably would have held up a lot better than this. Than this, uh, than this. Um, and as far as the flavor itself, this taco shell does not taste good. It just tastes like ground up corn, ice cream, really sickeningly sweet, um, chocolate syrup, but some good ice cream and good whipped topping and sprinkles. Uh, as far as a BevNerd review rating for the chocolate taco dessert kit, I give this a D for dumb. Uh, this is just a dumb idea. Um, this is a mess. Imagine kids are going to want to make eat these. Uh, you're going to be making a huge mess. The chocolate shells themselves just taste like corn and it doesn't mix well with ice cream or any of the ingredients and it even tastes stale even um, even if the pack was just open they stay they still taste a little stale 
and they're just ugh, not good. Um, anyways, if you know, if you want more information, just go to TacoBell.com. I'm sure you can find these anywhere you look, like Walmart or whatever. But I would definitely pass on these. I'm sitting there holding this under here, but that stinks. These are not good. Uh, if you want more Bevnerd reviews, uh, go to Bevnerd.com. Follow me on Facebook, facebook.com slash Bevnerd. I'm on Twitter and Instagram at Bevnerd. And send me a plain old email at Bevnerd at gmail.com. I'm going to go wash my hands.